Curextrata makes it really simple to convert EBCDIC files into the ASCII format that you typically work with. To demonstrate, we'll locate an EBCDIC file on our computer and simply open it. This file had the common .ebc extension, but Strata will open up EBCDIC files with .txt extensions too. Okay, so here we're looking at the encoded data. To convert it, we'll just toggle to the source view. So we'll just change our encoding to EBCDIC, and then we're going to add our field breaks. And finally, we'll add some field names. And now we'll toggle over to the design view, which shows us our structure. This file contains all character types, except for the birthday field, which is a date. So we can just change that field type, and then we can toggle to the table view and save our changes. Okay, we're getting close, but our first field is still in EBCDIC format. Because text files often include additional encoding, Strata enables you to define these manually when necessary. So we just toggle back to our source view, explicitly add the EBCDIC encoding, and then toggle back to the table view. And now that we've got our file, we can start working with it. For instance, we could hide the carriage return field from our view, or we can mark all the people who have birthdays before June of 1968, and then we could filter on all the people who live in Massachusetts. And importantly, at any time, we can save the file to our project, or we can transform it into a different file format altogether. In this case, we'll save it onto our computer as a Microsoft Excel file. So that was a very quick look at how Strata makes it really easy to open up EBCDIC files and start working with them. To give it a try with your own data, download a free trial of Curic Strata from our website and let us know if you have any questions. Thanks.